So a question I get asked a lot is, how long is it going to take for me to see results when I start GLP-1s for weight loss? So if you don't know who I am, I'm Tiffany. I'm a physician assistant, and I'm a huge advocate to help people get weight loss drugs and GLP-1s uh, to get healthy. So really, your success when you start a GLP-1 depends on a couple of different things. And the main thing is where we're starting at. So when we look at the studies of GLP-1s, we're looking at an average of 10 to anywhere from 10 to 20% of your entire body weight. So because it's a percentage, it really depends on what your starting weight is. So let's just use an example. Someone who's 200 pounds at the beginning of their journey, um, let's say they are, can lose about 20% of their body weight. Well, that's going to be about 40 pounds. But if you've got somebody who is 300 pounds at the beginning of their journey, then their potential to lose is quite a bit more. Now, in reality, I have actually seen this be more weight than the 10 to 20%. I've actually had lots of patients that are losing uh, 50, 60, 70 pounds, and uh, that was far more than the 10 to 20% that we saw in the studies. So just take that for what it's worth, but that is not completely across the board. So um, everybody's experience is gonna be rather different. I will also say that in the average first month, people tend to lose about 5% of their body weight. So the results actually usually start rather quickly, which is good. Um, unfortunately though, there are potential side effects that come along with GLP-1s. The biggest side effect is always, always nausea. Um, that side effect does tend to get better uh, the longer that you're on the drug. Um, so sometimes right at the beginning, people can have a lot of nausea with the drug until they kind of figure out their eating. Um, and then once they change their eating and figure it out, then it gets a lot better. Um, however, some people, as the dose escalates up, their nausea can get a little bit worse. So lots of things to factor in, but the good news is, is that when you start GLP-1 therapy, for the most part, you're going to be seeing results pretty quickly. Now, obesity is a chronic condition, meaning that it needs chronic treatment. So I don't ever recommend people just get on a GLP-1 for one or two months and then discontinue it because that doesn't usually do anything to help you long term. So for the most part, I usually recommend that people get on a GLP-1, they get really close to their weight loss goal, um, and then we talk about ways to maintain that, whether or not that that means staying on the GLP-1 at a lower dose or other maintenance therapies. But at the end of the day, obesity is chronic and we need to treat it like a chronic condition. So you're going to see success. It's usually gonna be pretty quick, um, which is exciting for people because patience is really hard to have when we're looking for weight loss. So if you have questions or concerns, let me know, drop them in the comments. There is a link in my bio. If you are looking for access to weight loss medication and GLP-1s that you should be able to get started. You can actually get started with semaglutide for as little as $99 a month, or you can get started on terzepatide for as little as $199 a month. So that has opened up access to a lot of people who did not have access before. So just click the link in my bio to get started. All right, y'all have a wonderful Sunday.